Hi everyone, it's Az here from Heel vs. Babyface and the first trailer for Hawkeye just dropped, releasing November the 4th on Schnizny Schnush. And uh, <laughs> I just, uh, I don't even, I barely even know what to say anymore. I, not that I don't know what to say anymore. But uh, once again, it's been received very well so far. If I just uh, shrinkage. 132,000 upvotes to just 600 downvotes. That is a very, very positive reaction to this trailer. Which I personally thought was shite. <laughs> I, just, I just thought it was shite! It started off okay. Hawkeye is uh, is back with his family. He's making up for lost time, as he says, because of um, you know the Avengers stuff. Uh, he only talks to his daughter because his sons are dead to him. And then I see this. Rogers the musical. Ah, oh, sweet fucking Jesus. Because Steve Rogers is now just a, what, a joke now? He's just a, he's just a joke, I guess. Oh, God. If the, if, if this is a specific humor that I just don't get or don't find funny, I guess it's just me, huh? So anywho, they do some Christmas shopping and then he looks on the news. And what do we see? A masked vigilante dressed up in his Ronin outfit. Clearly female. I don't I don't even think the show's trying to, to hide that. Clearly female. And then we have a quick flashback to uh to Jeremy Renner as Ronin in uh, Endgame where he was uh, hacking away at the Yakuza. Why? Because he was operating off the logic of uh, my family were good and they died in the, in the blip and you shouldn't be allowed to live. That was his logic. You're evil, you shouldn't be allowed to live. And it's just like, oh, my past is, is catching up with me. And it's all kind of like serious at the moment. And do you know, apart from the Rogers, the in musical. And he's just like, don't worry, don't worry. I'll be back before Christmas. You can see he's got an earpiece in now. I'll be back before Christmas. I'll sort this out. So his family goes away. And then suddenly Marvel Studios hits and... It's the most wonderful time of the year. This show's a fucking joke. La 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 la. So it just really changed the tone completely to this being some sort of shitty ass comedy. So he's stalking the person who's wearing his outfit. He catches up to them. And he's like, oh, when I wore that suit, it got me into a lot of trouble. Takes off the mask. And it's Kate Bishop. And she's like, oh my God, you're like the Horkaisies. I could be playing The Witcher 3 right now. I really could. I'm, 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 I'm too old for the shit. I'm probably too high in IQ. And that's not, that's not a flex. That's not a flex. You just got to have an IQ of three or above now, I think. Uh, so anyway. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is where my... This is why I just can't invest in these shows. She introduced... She says, some call me... You know, he's like, what do you call yourself or who are you? And she says, some call me the greatest archer that ever lived or the greatest archer on the planet and i'm just like 
Oh, just fuck off. Because, of course, as you may know, we are now balls freaking deep in the MCU where you don't ever show how somebody gets to the level that they're at. You just tell them. You just tell them. I'm all, I'm Kate Bishop, bitch, and I'm already the best archer on the planet. I could be in bed. I could just be sleeping. Just, you know, that rather, if you think about it, unsettling unconsciousness that we fall into every day fall into unconsciousness so that may we wake up and be reborn anyway let's just let's move on let's move on uh so she uh she hits the shot and it just crumbles the clock tower and it makes a lot of noise ha 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 uh they talk this more most wonderful time of the year i think his wife or his daughter calls him and he's just like don't worry yeah yeah, yeah i'll be back a couple of days back in a couple of days he'll be reet he'll be fine we see people coming after them a guy throws a molotov through the window hawkeye grabs the molotov throws it back at him it's pretty cool but you know that's hawkeye to me not this dumb, shitty, flipping Kate Bishop whose comic fails and fails and they put her in with a group like the West Coast Avengers or the Champions or something and it fails and it fails. Stick her with uh, flipping Casper Van Diem and it fails and it fails. Why? Because she's not a fucking interesting character. She's fake hawkeye just like riri williams is fake iron man just like captain marvel is fake fucking everything just like sh this current iteration of she hulk is fake hulk <sighs> anyway let's carry on i'm pretty sure my video's been ratioed to hell don't it's fine I just can't, I just cannot invest in this dog shit. So we see some flapping about Hawkeye's, sorry, I should really say Clint Barton, considering if you go to the credits of this, it's Kate Bishop, which has got the Hawkeye moniker. Jesus, God, I don't mean moniker from Friends either. Hawkeye's like, ah, no, slipsy poosies, slipsy woozies, falls, look. Look, I've got ice packs taped everywhere because I fellsy wellsy over. Ah, it's so funny. Oh, the gangs are after him again. Zip lines swinging. I don't even, can't even remember what they call these things. Whatever smashing. If it gets to me, I remember. Ow, I landed on a thingsy wingsy this holiday season. Look, it's it's Rogers the musical. Fuck off. Just Jesus fucking off. Oh my god. I'm sorry. I've just seen the trailer like 30 seconds before i hit the record button i was like fuck it let's just open this shit up and do it and my after seeing the trailer you you have to understand that my heart was already in the pit of my stomach <laughs> yeah you know it was already in the pit of my stomach i was already deflated by the time I, before i even said a word to, to talk about this look we got a oh fuck right. that's the hulk you know uh, we got a, we got a Loki, maybe. We got a Thor. We got a Hawkeye. We got a Black Widow. We got an Iron Man. 
some sh Jitari. Don't just want to hang yourself, you know. Find a nice rafter somewhere, you know. A nice railway sleeper, real thick. You know, that's never going to break. Holy shit, you could hang an elephant for one of them. That'd ah, be fine. Just, just let yourself go into sweet oblivion other than have to deal with this fucking bullshit. Uh, anyway, moving on. I'm, I think my brain's meant to be keeping stuff up here and it's coming out the mouth. There's a dog with antlers. Laugh. Laugh. It's funny. Uh, then we see them walking in tuxedos and then a tree falls down and more villains come after them. More women, probably. That's the, the best thing I've seen in this trailer so far. Crispy chicken sandwich. Yeah, I wouldn't mind one. Well, thank you. And uh, Hawkeye's driving, so Kate's doing the shooting and she shoots and the car blows up just like it did in falcon and uh sorry in captain america and winter soldier just like it did in black widow same fucking trick over and over and over and over and over and over and over again trust a bro moving company ah uh, yeah okay trust a bro and then she's like wowzy dad have you got like any more dangerous arrows and heresies? And then I I realize I realize that um it's all it's all over, isn't it? It's just all it's all I'm like Hawkeye's like mm, maybe wabies mm, maybe wabies I got some more dangerous these arrowsies oh my god these I've wasted way too much of my life. Look, they're falling down, shooting stuff. It's the most wonderful time of the year. I think it looks shit. 